The cracks in Antarctica's vast Wilkins ice shelf show just how rapidly it's melting. A team from the British Antarctic Survey has discovered the hulk of ice, which just 50 years ago was 100 kilometers wide, is now held in place by a strip of ice only 500 meters wide at its narrowest point, and that could collapse within days. Once that happens, sea currents are likely to sweep away the rest. The team filmed these huge icebergs floating around the shelf, which have broken off as it disintegrates. The ice shelf is still here, and I, I'm actually surprised that it's lasted as long into this summer as it has. It really could go at any minute, and uh, uh, I wouldn't be at all surprised if the final, the final cracks started to appear very soon. News of Wilkins' demise coincides with new research from scientists at Washington University who say Antarctica is warming more than previously thought. Until now, incomplete data led experts to believe part of the continent was actually cooling. But using the latest technology, the US team say over the past 50 years, the most vulnerable area, West Antarctica, has warmed by half a degree. If West Antarctica melts, it could eventually raise sea levels around the world by several meters. That will have a devastating impact, particularly in countries like the United Kingdom. The public should put as much pressure as they can on their policymakers and their leaders to reach an agreement and to take the necessary actions to reduce greenhouse gas emissions. Wilkins will be the 10th Antarctic ice shelf to vanish into the sea in half a century. Some had been in place for 10,000 years. Most climate scientists say the new research is the latest sign that global warming is happening more severely and quickly than many thought. Catherine Jacobs, Sky News.